Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is CKT Chaotic. Today I will be reading Marry My Husband, episode 53, due to Webtoon's new policy for 2023. I do have the blur 50% of this episode, so if you guys want to read along with me, it's available on webtoons.com. And for anyone out there who wants to support me, I do have all these uploads on my private channel on patreon.com slash CKT Chaotic. You guys can also gain early access. There will be no censorship, no cat logo, no blur. So if that's something up your alley, definitely check it out. Let's go ahead and get started. My voice sounds a lot deeper today, so for some reason. Okay, zoom in. I told you not to call me. I don't want anything from you, Dad. Are you still living with that woman? Why are you asking me that? To share some good news with her. I'm calling her to tell her that her only daughter is marrying into one of the wealthiest families in the country. Marry My Husband, Episode 53. One of the wealthiest families in the... Oh, one of the wealthiest families in the country. Yes, so tell her to pay her daughter a visit. I'm sure G1 would be sad if her own mother didn't come to her wedding. Your time is up. Look for Jiyuan King, who works at UNK Food Marketing Team 1. And don't tell her you heard the news from me. Say you saw it on the news. I hope he heard that last part. I'm sure he did. Click. Once UNK Group finds out that Jiwan's from a crappy family, they'll cut ties with her. Shh. <laughs> Oh, it'll be fun watching her downfall. You and Kay. Jiyuk, are you getting off work soon? I'll be waiting on the first floor. Oh, Miss Kang. Uh, you should go down to the lobby. Someone's looking for you. Oh, uh, huh? Who's looking for me? Whisper. It's your mother. Uh. She's telling people she's your mother and asking if she could speak with you. Dun dun. My mother? No, there's no way. She's probably mistaken me for someone else. My mom left years ago. There's no way she came back. G1, is that you? Are you my daughter? Goodness, it, it is you. It really is you. How have you been? I should have come sooner. I didn't even want to get to watch you grow into a, such a beautiful young woman. It's the woman from the photograph. She's my mom. My mom is here. My mom came back to see me. But, why did you want to see me all of a sudden? You never reached out over the years. It was because I felt awful about what I did to you. I was too ashamed to see you. I tried more than a thousand times to reach out, and even went to your house a few times, but couldn't bring myself to follow through with it. How did you know where to find me? Oh, I asked around and found out through the grapevine. Chi Wan, I know I'm a terrible mother, and I won't ask you to forgive me, but I hope you'll let me see you from time to time. That's all I want. Uh, here's your order. Where should I put the or omu rice? Over there. You still love eggs? You used to love eating egg rice when you were little. Do you remember me when I was young? Of course. Everyone always commented on how pretty you were. <laughs> it was no surprise because you were this small, precious baby with adorable smile. If I was so cute and pretty, why did you leave me? Why did you take all our money and disappear? Why didn't you come to Dad's funeral? 
Why don't you try to look for me sooner? <laughs> I have so many questions for her, but I don't want to ask them. I don't care if she gives excuses. Tonight, I want to hear what my mom has to say. You live in such a nice apartment. I'm so happy to see that you're doing well. You're welcome to come up if you'd like. <laughs> no, I should go. You must be tired. Go home and get some rest. I just overjoyed that we got to have dinner together and go on a short walk. Thank you for spending time with me, Juan. Even though I showed up out of the blue. Feel free to give me a call if you miss me. Uh, can I ask you a question? What is it? Did you see the news about me getting married? Uh, are you getting married, Yuan? Well, congratulations, so sweetie. Did you set a date? Can I come to your wedding? No, because I'm not getting married. The article was false. I am in a serious relationship, though. Still, you must be someone you love very much. Even though you didn't have the best parents in the world, I suppose you've been blessed with a great partner. I'm glad that you seem to have a, met a good person. All I want is for you to be happy, sweetie. Okay, mom. Hello? I met with G1. So, what did she say? My goodness, hold your horses. Why are you so impatient? Because I don't have time. I had to pay my promise, prom, promissory note and pay our employee this month. Give me a little time. Her boyfriend's family is filthy rich. <laughs> I'll try to get my hands on a huge sum of money that will be more than enough to cover everything, including your business funds. <laughs> huh? <gasps> uh, who's that? Who, who are you? Step, step, step. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Jiwon's boyfriend. Chiyuk Yu. Oh, oh, I did not expect him to actually be right there at the right time to catch her saying all of that. <gasps> Whoa, I would think like, I would think the plot would continue a lot longer with like the mom pretending to love Jiwon and they just continue to build their relationship and everything. And then later on the, the tea spill and Jiwon's like disappointed. But oh my gosh. <laughs> The plot just started and it ended so quickly by Mr. Yu. Oh, oh, the drama is piping hot. All right, guys, if you guys enjoyed my webtoon reaction slash reading style, feel free to subscribe, leave a thumbs up, drop some comments, and I'll catch you guys next time. Bye!